Thursday night brings us five games in the can. We got goodies in all of them. Let's get right to it. My name is Andrea Sachinka, and you're watching Daily KHL Update. We travel to one of the best hockey towns in Russia first. Welcome to Chelabinsk. It's home of Tractor, and tonight they face Red Army. The hosts get really close to getting on the board late in the first as Nikita Tartishny tries to redirect a pass to Van Fidatum, but the puck hits the bar. The red and blue break the ice soon after that. Artem Blazievsky shoots from the blue line and Lucas Walmart gets his lumber on it. Trucker tied up three minutes later. Alexey Bovalsov steals the puck, feeds team of Pulkinen and he scores his sixth of the year. Man in black strike again, meter through the second. Vladimir Kachov puts his skill on display and scores a beauty. The Red Army have a man advantage early in the third. Lucas Walmark with the scoring chance by Roman Will comes across just in time to make a great save. That proves to be enough. Truck to take it 2 1 at home ice. Make our way to Matishi, Moscow region now where Kun Lone Red Star face off against Amor. It's late in the opening period, 4 on 4 hockey, Andre Alexeyev blazes to the net on a B-way and beats Alexander Lazushin for his first of the season. Second period now, Tyler Wan feeds wide open Ethan Warwick for a one-timer, but Evgeny Aliki pulls off a fantastic save. The Tigers double their lead with a short-headed marker. Turnover in the neutral zone, another breakaway, and Gleb Zuranov scores against his former team. The Dragons find the back of the net, meter to the third, but it's waved off of the video review. Goal interference is the call. Again, Alekin stops 30 shots for his first shutout of the season, and Amor enjoy a 2 0 win on the road. Move on to Cherpa Vets, where Sarastal do battle with Dynamo Riga. Late in the first, Hunter Shin Garrett makes a cross ice pass for a sure goal, but Lucas Rydell misses the net wide. He's still looking for his first goal of the year. Sarastal get a man advantage right before the intermission. Captain Igor Morozov receives the puck down low. Nice move and a shot. Jochen Matson with the save. The host convert on a two man advantage meter through the second. Robin Press sends it home with a one timer of a setup by Jakob Stenfest. Dynamo course overtime with a late power play goal. Oscar Sibolskis hits the twine with a shot from mid point. Extra period of play, and Milpour again muscles his way to the slot. Mitra Shugayev gives up a fat rebound and makes a great blocker save on Hunter Shinkarek's follow up attempt. The host for the winner right after that. Igor Guraskin takes matters into his own hands and scores a gorgeous goal. Terrestal gets their second W in a row. 2 1 into final. Moving on to St. Petersburg, where SKA play host to Salawati Live. First period, Captain Grigory Panin finds himself in the slot, takes a backhand shot, and Lars Juhansson stops it with his glove. Salawat opens scoring on their first power play attempt of the night. Sakara Moninin with an absolute snipe. They score another one on a man advantage two minutes later. Shakir Mukhamadolin fires home his first of the season. Alexander Kadekin has a great chance to extend the lead soon after that, but it hits the post. Steal a 2 0 game. The Bears is throw another one past Yukonson early in the third. Karaka Kirkovnes is second of the year. Leafs prospect Rodion Amiro picks up his first point at his first game of the year. SPA get a goal back five minutes later. Anton Bordasov scores his sixth of the year of assist by Anton Kirsanov and Daniil Polikov. Kirill Marchinko tries to skate behind the net meter for the period, but Grigory Bonin shuts the door. What a hit! SKA pull back to within one late in regulation with the extra attacker out. Evgeny Tinkin with the marker. But 40 seconds later, Salavat put it on ice. Daniil Bashkirov scores on the empty net, and this one is in the books. Salavat take two points on the road as they beat SKA 4 2 in St. Petersburg. Our last game of the night takes place in Sochi. The Leopards meet undefeated Dynamo Moscow. 
We'll pick it up late in the second. 20-year-old defenseman Andre Pribelski drops down low and scores his first career KHL goal. Early in the third, now Osman rush for Dynamo and 20-year-old Vladislav Mihailov improves the lead for Moscow. And then they score two more in the span of less than a minute late in regulation. First, Eric Odell converts on a power play. And then rookie Dmitry Roshevsky nets his sixth of the season. Veteran Alexander Yeremenko stops 28 shots for a shutout, and Dynamo remain the only team in the league without a single lost point. 4 0 is your final. And that's it for a daily KHL update, but do come back tomorrow for two more games. Hogbars will host Admiral, while Spartak will visit Neftekimek. My name is Andrea Sachinka, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.